Over the years, Instagram has evolved into the premier destination for influencer marketing and short form video content. While you can basically create content at a moment's notice using your cell phone, in this edition of The Grind, we're gonna show you how you can create high quality Instagram content quickly and easily using your PC. So we're gonna be using Expert Broadcaster to record from our PC. So the first thing is we need to set the proper resolution. So if you're gonna be making a standard Instagram post, you wanna set it to 1080 by 1350. If this is gonna be a story, you're gonna to wanna to set it to 1080 by 1920, and then set the frame rate to 30 FPS. And now let's change a couple recording settings. So go into the recording menu and then go into the settings, change the quality to standard, and then enable force constant frame rate if you'll be editing this later. So the main advantage of using Expert Broadcaster to record your footage is that you can use the different sources to basically make a finalized product that needs minimal editing so you can upload your content right away. So you can add your game source, or a capture card source if you wanna show PC or console gameplay. You can add your face cam and resize it if you wanna show some reactions. And the cool thing is, is that if you're adding these 16 by nine sources to this four by five or nine by 16 aspect ratio, you can basically full size the 16 by nine source. And in the blank spaces on the top and bottom, you can use the color mat to basically fill this in and you can add the text source if you wanna add a caption or something that's catching to the eye. Really the possibilities are endless. You can check the links above for more videos on more expert features and sources to kind of, you know, make that really cool Instagram post. So now that you have your scene set, you can actually do a recording. So starting and stopping a recording is pretty simple, but I recommend setting a hotkey and using this in conjunction with macros, to basically set a countdown timer. So you can say, start recording in five seconds. That way you can set yourself into place and do like a single take for your recording. You can also pause recording. So if you need to basically skip ahead or kind of ignore a certain segment, you can pause the recording and then restart it when you want to do the take again. And basically when you're done with your recordings, you can dump these into your video editor of choice. Or if you want to upload those right away, I know you need to use your phone. So I recommend using something like Google Drive or Dropbox, uploading it there, installing the apps on your phone, downloading the videos, and then uploading it directly to Instagram from there. Pretty straightforward with doing recordings. Unfortunately, Instagram, unless you use some paid apps or services, you can't just really upload directly to the site. But now I want to know from you, do you upload videos to Instagram and what advantages or disadvantages do you feel Instagram has in comparison to other social video platforms? And what do you use to edit your Instagram videos? Let me know in the comments, give a like and share this video if it was helpful and make sure to subscribe for more ways to stay on the grind.